Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. Thank god we got our microphone back in uh, pristine condition again so we can actually do this. God, I, I am so sorry about these last several Click Clock Wood videos. They have been complete crap. They have. They have been complete crap. Crap all the cuck. And, uh, just, I wish I could do them over because that's like the low point of this LP, this entire world. Cause this, I love this world and I just wasn't feeling it when I was doing the LP of it or something. And of course, the fact that my microphone was all quiet didn't really help matters that much. In fact, I don't know why I'm showing this because I already... Well, I got one more jiggy to get. I know where it is and I just have to go get it. And that involves going to Mumbo's Hut, which I'm just going to take this little route here because it seems to be the safest. Yeah, how do you like that? Pretty good, huh? <laughs> I didn't even take a hit. Thought I was gonna fall in the bramble patch and ruin my uh, success there. Oh god, speaking of success, holy shit, you guys. Oh, something yesterday happened that was so amazing, I can't even. I can't really talk about it, I don't think, but <laughs> it's good. I'm just not sure if I'm gonna be. Oh, I don't know. But, like I said, I was. I mean, if it if it does work out, I guess, I'll let you guys know about it, but holy crap. Anyway, the Jiggy I missed is uh, way up high. I was, I was right there at it at the end of the last video. Basically, you just gotta go as high as you possibly can and keep looking around, and eventually you'll find the Jiggy. There it is. No problem. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you can use your R button, you know. Okay, can we just, like, land here? That would be great. It's so slippery. It's so slippery. I just want to ground pound. I want to ground pound. There. We got it. Haha, -ha, flower's not going to eat me. I'm a bee, so the flower's not going to eat me. Hit, <laughs> I'm a bee, so the flower's not going to eat me. Alright, so that's all ten jiggies in Click Clock Wood. Now we have to exit Click Clock Wood as a bee and get the final Jiggy in Gruntilda's Lair, and that will give us all 100 Jiggies. Next step after that, I guess, is to uh, progress to uh, the game show, but what I want to do in between is actually make a quick video in which I go to all the Gruntilda locations and discover all the unique aspects of Grunty's nastiness, including what color her underwear is, what she likes to eat, what magazines she likes to read, I'm going to need all that information for the game show segment coming up, which is actually, to me, one of the coolest parts of the game. and something I wish they did more of in games, actually. But, we will get to that when we get there. Man, I'm going to need to, like, go to Office Depot or something. Okay, so there you go. Ten Jiggies and Gratilda's Lair. Taking a dump, taking a dump, taking a dump. Yeah! So down we go. Okay, Mumbo, it's time for your Verizon magic to run out, so go ahead. Mumbo magic, good week. Die. Magic run out. I'm so sorry, Mumbo. I'm so sorry about it. I actually started Banjo 2 yesterday, so I'm practicing on it finally. And I'm telling you, the intro to that game is so freaking long that it's going to take two videos just to do that. I'm telling you. Anything special in here? Not really. Question marks. Tootie pad. I don't know what that's all about. <gasps> We're here already? Oh man, we can't be here already. I'm not ready for this. I guess I'm gonna have to go talk to Brentilda. Welcome all, Grunty's the name. Banjo's here to play my game. My lair is done, and here he stands, through all my tricks and traps and lands. This final test will see me win. When Banjo fails, then I'll be thin. The prize is on this stand bring joy. From Tootie down to Cuddly Toy. But Tootie was just in the machine. What did you do, take her back out? You, my little quiz will make you sweat, and Tootie you shall never get, cause somewhere soon along the way, your lack of skill will make my day, and you will pay, I say, cause in the fiery pit you'll go, and I will win the prize on show, and you will be nothing but dough. So step on the square, press A to try it, if you dare, or chicken out, and see my underwear. Anyway, there's another secret pot back here, I don't actually know where this one goes. But, uh, use it. Oh, I can't. I don't know where the other one is. Okay, so I'm gonna go um, talk to Brentilda now. And I don't know where all the locations are, so I gotta look them up. So, uh, um, 
Yeah, I, I will see you in a minute. Hang on. Okay, so it's time to get the dirt on Grunty by talking to her sister Brentilda. This is the left side of the room with the Click Clock Wood entrance, which is right up there. So that's Click Clock Wood. And, uh, here's Brenty. Gruesome Gruntilda's favorite pastime is flying radio-controlled bats. Ew. Let's hear some more. This poor guy called Dirty Birdie was her first and only boyfriend. Ew. When she was younger, Grunty used to have a mad vulture as a pet. Ooh, you poor tears, you're low on health. Okay, next location. Okay, on top of the giant grunty head over here, there's another Gruntilda. Let's get some more dirt on her. The disgusting Gruntilda has spider pancakes for breakfast. Ew! Your feathered buddy. I'm not talking to you right now. That you've brung useless like a pile of dung. God. Then she usually has slug stew for dinner. Ugh, oh, what about dessert? Wart bags then finishes with cockroaches and cream for dessert. How horrid! <laughs> okay, out here by the entrance to Mad Monster Mansion, behind one of the graves, there's another location here. Did you know Wart Bags keeps a dragon's foot in her pocket? Oh man. I've also seen my sister cuddling a huge sweaty baboon in bed at night. Ooh! She's really proud of her broomstick. It's a top-of-the-range Lordmaster 2000! Nice! Okay, this one's a little harder. You have to turn into a pumpkin and get across the narrow path here, but here we go. <coughs> Revolting Gruntilda's bedroom has rotting fish hanging from the ceiling. Ooh! That is disgusting. She also has a loogie bush growing in a pot beside her bed. Filthy old bag! And you'd be sick if you saw... No, I'd be sick if you saw her enormous sweaty yellow undies. Oh my god. Ah. Okay, back here behind the entrance to Gobi's Valley. Another one. Grunty's best friend at witch school was the awful Fatty Hattie. Ew. When relaxing, she usually reads Warty Girls Weekly magazine. And finally, while sipping a glass of her favorite... Cold worm juice. <sighs> I can't take this anymore, man. Okay, behind the giant grunty statue here is another location. My lazy sister often sleeps in a pigsty, the dirty hag. <laughs> the only thing she's ever won was the dirtiest undies competition. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> she often boasts of appearing on the cover of Fat Hag Monthly. Polishing her crystal ball. Oh, you poor dears. Yeah, I know. Okay, so outside the entrance to Bubble Gloop Swamp, there's a... She's down one of the tunnels here. My fat old sister's favorite sport is belly barging. Ew. Although she's dim, she attended Fat Hag High. And... You won't believe that Gruntilda's party trick is eating a bucket of beans! Oh, well, that explains how she won the dirtiest undies contest now, doesn't it? Okay, so in the room with the click clock wood puzzle, this hidden room back here, which you, you have to keep talking just as I'm coming up to her to lump around that squawking jerk. Here we go. Ugly Grunty's nickname was Jelly Belly at which school? <laughs> Jelly. Hey, Jelly Belly. I also know that sweaty gorilla feet is her favorite smell. <laughs> oh, yuck. And the old hag's favorite color is gruesome green, baby. Okay, so right here outside of uh, the Clanker's Cavern entrance, there's another one. Grunty wears a reinforced girdle under that repulsive dress of hers. Ooh. Oh, sorry. She also got this nasty pet dog whose name is Ripper. Ooh, Ripper, okay. My sister sings in her own band, Grunty and the Monster Mob. They're awful! And finally, we have one here in the room with the Treasure Trove Cove puzzle. Here it is. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with tuna ice cream flavored toothpaste. Ooh! She also washes her hair with baked beans! 
Ooh! And she gets her clothes from Saggy Maggie's Boutique. Well, that's very disgusting. Now that we have all the dirt, we can go to the game show and get the questions right. So I will see you then on Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. Take care, y'all, and uh, happy throwing up.